Are you all right, Ilya? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Where is everyone else? I don't see them anywhere. They should be around here. Maybe. Then again, me tripping back there threw off our timing pretty badly. There's a chance we're a good distance away from each other. Well, we picked a good place to appear. Let's go look for them in this village first. Hang on. I, I just realized this outfit probably isn't gonna work here. You're right. You'd stick out like a sore thumb. Why don't you wait here? I'll go find something for you. Sorry for the trouble, but imagine what the captain must be going through. Well, good luck then. Ilya, I've got your clothes. Here you go. Thanks. No peeking now. Hmm, I'm sorry to complain, but this is just too small. Well, I'll just go like this then. Oh, are you sure? Well, there's nothing else I can do. I can't change back into what I had on earlier. Anyway, let's hurry. We need to stock up on supplies and rendezvous with the captain. I'm not really sure what just happened here. The first thing we need to do is visit all the nearby settlements. The captain's bound to turn up in one of them. Sounds good to me. That ain't true and you know it! Stop screwing with me, you bastard!
Adam, I heard you were looking for someone to run an errand for you over to Portmouth. Yeah, I've got some cargo I need delivered from the Portmouth weapon shop, but I can't find anyone handy who'd be up to the job. It's been kind of tough to cross Mount Maytorx lately, hasn't it? Well, I'll let you know if I find anyone who can help. Welcome. I heard you needed someone to do a run over to Portmouth for you. Yep, there's some cargo I need delivered from the weapon shop in Portmouth. You'll get paid for your trouble, of course, and I'll also give you a permit to enter Portmouth. Sound good to you? Portmouth? The town to the north of here. We need a permit to enter? You just come off the boat, lady? They don't let anyone into that town if you don't have the right permit. We'd like to take the job, sir. Hmm. Well, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but you're gonna need a real weapon. Oh, well, we'll come back later then. this sword grab you? Oh, it's a masterpiece from a mystical Eastern blacksmith. I'll cut you a deal on it, hmm? My, that's an impressive piece of work. How about we buy it, Roddick? Yeah, we'll have trouble ahead if we don't have a good longsword on our side. I'll make it twenty-four, all right? Half price just for you. Sounds good. <laughs> Thank you much. Whoa, 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 whoa. You just hold it right there. Trying to palm your junk off on some poor, unsuspecting loser, huh? Oh, great. You again. Oh, stop messing with me, business. Shut up when I'm talking to you. Look, you guys are adventurers, right? Take it from me. This guy's sword is nothing but a big fake. I mean, if that was really an Eastern masterpiece or whatever, it would look more like a... a... Well, it, it wouldn't look like that. Well, anyway, just keep your guard up against this guy. He'll rob you blind. See ya. That was quite a character. Sorry, folks, but I've just assigned the job to that guy, right there. What? Oh, come on! You two again, huh? You already promised the job to these guys? I'd better stay out of the way then. I'm sorry. I just didn't think they'd actually show up. I mean, they look so green. Well, how about if I lend them one of my spare swords then, huh? That work for you? No, wait. Could you go with these guys? I'll let them go if you do. I'm just too nervous to send them out on their own. <laughs> You're the boss. Sounds like we're partners now. Wanna go to Portmouth? Sorry to bother you about this. Hey, we're all in this together, right? The name's C.S. Warren. Good to meet you. 
My name is Roddick Ferentz. Please call me Roddick. Yeah, CS works for me too. We don't have to be formal. Well, uh, Roddick is the name. Don't wear it out. <laughs> My name's Elia Silvestri. Glad to meet you, Cius. First names work for me, too. Well, in that case, here's your advance and the permit. Best of luck. So, you're looking for some friends, huh? That's gotta be a pain in the tail. Oh, it is. Are you traveling for any particular reason yourself? Um... <laughs> to work on my swordsmanship. Oh, you seem more than strong enough to me. <laughs> it's a big world out there, you know? Who goes there? No one's allowed in without a proper permit. We've got a permit, see? Very well. Pardon my rudeness. We've been getting a number of monster activity reports lately. Take care of yourselves out there. Thanks. So where's the weapon shop that Batam was talking about? Sorry, don't know this town too well. Well, let's look. Agreed.
What's up? Adam sent us. Ah, the delivery man, are you? Right. I need you to take this item to Batham for me. This thing? All the way back there? How the hell are we gonna carry this? I'm counting on you, folks. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're back. Here it is. Oh, that was quick. Here's your payment, then. Well, I got my money. Back to the treasure hunt, I suppose. Treasure hunt? Well, I found an abandoned mine earlier in my travels. It's on the Matorx mountain path, but I haven't checked it out much. It's packed with some serious monsters. Thanks for everything, Sias. You were a big help. See you then. It was kind of fun, I gotta admit. It takes all kinds, I suppose.